I'm Django Svone, just got back from uh, Peru, from the Amazon in Peru where I've been uh, living the last six years, studying and uh, working as a shaman. The reason uh, I've been in the Amazon the last, the last six years is that uh, the shamanism among, in my own tribe, the Sami tribe, is pretty much eradicated since uh, it was a heavy persecution of it for, uh, for uh, centuries. So that's pretty much gone and the only way to learn my own culture was to travel to the last place on earth I would ever want to go and that's the Amazon. But the Amazon is so dense and so inaccessible that uh, the missionaries and politicians never managed to, to destroy the shamanism. So that's where I had to go. What is shamanism? Shamanism is uh, evolution. It's uh, techniques to uh, grow and evolve as a human being. It's techniques how to heal. The difference between uh, humans and other animals is that although other animals can learn things, they'll never change their way of thinking, of being, they never transcend. But uh, that's uh, what we can do and uh, that's the meaning of, of being born as a human, is to transcend. If we do that we could uh, solve most problems that we have in society. Problems with uh, env uh, env uh, environmental problems, criminality, suffering, drug problems, all of it. For example, uh, I was working for a long time at a center in Peru where we mainly was treating uh, drug addicts. Because uh, uh, Narcotics, for example, that's something that brings you away from uh, evolution. It's something that uh, destroys your uh, spirit and your body. And that's the opposite. But if you, know, if you learn how to find a way to transcend, there wouldn't be a need to, to get lost. San Pedro, that's a cactus from uh, South America, from the Andes and coast. And it's one of the tools in, in shamanism. Uh, plant medicine in general, you can say, it's, uh, it's a big part of shamanism. But it is, shamanism contains a lot of different uh, techniques and tools how to achieve what you want. San Pedro is one of them. And what's been happening now is that, um, well, shamanism has been uh, outlawed in large part of the world. Here, for example, in uh, Sápmi, this part that is invaded by Sweden, for example, it's been uh, illegal for many centuries. Now, officially, it is legal again, but uh, only officially, because uh, I'm right now uh, uh, charged with uh, a case because of it, uh, because they're pers still persecuting shamans. Uh, I received uh, some San Pedro uh, and uh, now they are trying to, uh, to cover up this uh, religious persecution by claiming it's a uh, drug charge, that it's narcotic. And that, that is a serious uh, that is a serious problem, not only for me, because it's not so much, this is not a question of me going to jail or not. This is a question for humanity, whether we are going to have a right in the future to grow and evolve as human beings. And if we don't have that right, if uh, a government comes in and exercises like a sensor over nature, deciding over plants, good and bad ones. In that case, we are pr 
pretty much uh, without the hope as a species on this planet. These plants, they have been around on uh, this earth for, for uh, thousands, hundreds and thousands of years. And also uh, human beings and, and these plants, we have been able to live in peace for, uh, for thousands of years, for a long, long time. And now, if the, during the last couple of decades, many governments have started to, to uh, interfere with this and start to play God. And, uh, and that's a system that, that can never work in the long time. So this is, uh, I'd say, the most important issue we have today in society. Because it's linked to, to everything else in society. That, that you can never limit a human. Because that's the, the old way it used to be during the Middle Age. That's what the Inquisi Inquisition did. It was the general idea that the king was appointed by God and uh, nobody could be wiser than the priest. And people should, uh, should accept their destiny to live in poverty or misery and have the reward in afterlife. But that's not the way it works. You, you have the ability and that's what you're meant to do is to transcend in this life. And that right is what's been what is questioned now. So the government right now is trying to do anything they can to 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 cover this up as a drug charge against me, against humanity. <laughs>